Hey guys, how's it going? Today we are looking at the epic DC Marvel crossover, Dark Side and Galactus, The Hunger by John Byrne. So let's get right into it. Okay, so this is an Elseworlds tale, obviously. Well, maybe not necessarily Elseworlds since it's a Marvel DC crossover, but um, this was kind of a big deal. Um, this was a fan suggestion to John Byrne at a convention. And I believe he said something to the effect of, what if Galactus ate Apocalypse? Because Galactus, the Fantastic Four villain, you know, he has to, he's a planet eater and Silver Sur Surfer is his herald and he finds uh, suitable planets for the planet devourer to ingest. So that's a, that's a tough gig, right? So anyway, um, dream come true book here. So, so great. Um, I think this particular thing is hard to come by. You can find this in trade paperback form with the DC Marvel crossovers. So it was written, penciled and inked by John Byrne. Colorist is Rick Taylor. Um, let's see. Special thanks to Mark uh, Galanis McFinn, who said to me, Galax tries to, Galactus tries to eat Apocalypse. Okay. What a great sentence, right? I could just see John Byrne's mind exploding to that. That's Apocalypse there. That looks, is that Earth? I don't even recognize my own planet, or it could be near Earth. But anyway, uh, John Byrne is a huge uh, Jack Kirby fan, so this is, must have been just a dream come true for him, Orion and Light Gray of the New Gods. Because uh, as we know, Jack Kirby created, co-created the Fantastic Four and Galactus with Stan Lee, jumped ship to DC Comics and went there to create uh, the new gods and Apocalypse and Darkseid. I mean, Darkseid's probably one of the best, most epic villains ever created. And definitely, oh, that's a great shot of the Silver Surfer there. The Silver Surfer doesn't get enough due for how cool he is. Um, probably like a cult favorite. There's some parademons flying around. So this is a fun story, pretty action-packed. A lot of space action going on, a lot of John Byrne goodness. I know this is, that's a great shot right there. I know this is like a minor pet peeve, but you know how Galactus uh, sometimes has like the blue pants and sometimes has the bare legs? Usually it's the blue pants, that's what I'm used to. And I found it a little distracting. It looked like he was in short shorts, but um, I'm just a weirdo like that. There's Desaad. Um, other than the last Galactus story, this had to be a trip for John Byrne to draw. Um, very cosmic, very over the top, very John Byrne. Lots of great pages like this. Silver Surfer clashing with Orion, the half son of Darkseid. John went on to draw. Um, Jack Kirby's Fourth World and the New Gods, and he's always uh, done a great job uh, homaging and just, you know, doing John or Jack Kirby stuff. You can tell that he's a huge fan of his work. Um, I wish they would do more of these DC Marvel crossovers. I know, bite my tongue, but maybe if uh, Disney buys DC Comics, that could all happen. I don't know if that'd be a good thing or a bad thing. Um, I mean, obviously it's a mixed bag with uh, DC or Disney buying, uh, you know, Star Wars and Marvel. Anyway, this is just like a 48 page book, just a one shot, one off story. Uh, that's pretty epic in scope. And if, you ha if you're not aware of it or you don't have it, I definitely recommend finding it and putting it in your collection. And I hope you enjoyed looking through that with me today. So please like and subscribe and I'll check you out later. Bye guys.